How to regrow your hair naturally Hair loss is on the rise, and while it might not have direct physical effects on your health, the emotional toll can be significant. There are different possible reasons for hair loss, genetics, hormone imbalances, fungal conditions of the scalp, stress, autoimmune diseases, and nutritional deficiencies. However, there are some things you can do to naturally regrow your hair. What is hair loss? Most people lose about 50 to 100 strands of hair per day. This may seem like a lot, but it's insignificant compared to the 100,000 hair follicles you have on your head. If you notice more than this amount of hair on your combs daily, or observe an area of your scalp having thinner hair, you may start to develop hair loss. The severity of hair loss can vary from a small area to the entire scalp. Treatment of hair loss may simply involve accepting the condition, which can also include shaving one's head. Interventions that can be tried include the medications minoxidil, or finasteride, hair transplant surgery, and natural remedies. What causes hair loss? Hair loss can have multiple causes. In some cases, there's a genetic component. Other times, it's a result of autoimmune disease, high stress levels, recent surgery, or illness, hair damage from bleach or dyes, scalp conditions, or vitamin deficiencies. Women are less likely to experience hair thinning in their 20s and instead may start to see symptoms in their 40s, 50s, and beyond. Male baldness can be triggered by high levels of sex hormones called androgens, thyroid conditions, medications, or nutritional disorders. Hair loss can also develop in response to hormonal imbalances or thyroid conditions. Pulling on your hair and wearing tight hairstyles can also contribute to hair loss over time. When should I see a doctor? Most people lose about 50 to 100 strands of hair per day. If you're noticing that you're losing more hair than average, it's worth discussing with your doctor, especially if hair loss is combined with other symptoms like fatigue, anxiety, itching, and mood changes. How to naturally regrow your hair If your situation is less alarming, some natural remedies can effectively help regrow your hair. 1. Massage your scalp It's thought that stretching during the massage encourages hair growth and thickness in the dermal papilla cells, which are located in the bottom of the hair follicle. These cells play a key role in the formation of hair, hair growth, and the shedding and regrowth cycle. Massage your scalp with your fingertips, not your fingernails. Move your way across your scalp in small circles, applying light to medium pressure. Each scalp massage should be given daily for 4 minutes for a period of 24 weeks. The bottom line, be patient and consistent. 2. Aloe Vera Aloe Vera gel has long been used for treating hair loss. It also soothes the scalp and conditions hair. It can reduce dandruff and unblock hair folds that may be blocked by excess oil. It is the best if you can apply pure aloe vera gel to your scalp and hair a few times per week. You can also use shampoo and conditioner that contain aloe vera to get some results. 3. Coconut Oil Coconut oil is known to contain fatty acids, called lauric acid that penetrate inside the hair shaft and reduce protein loss from hair. One study also found that coconut applied to the scalp helps enrich the scalp's microbiome, making the scalp and hair follicles healthier. 4. Fish Oil Consuming omega fatty acids can help improve your hair from the inside, since they are filled with nutrients and proteins. Taking an omega supplement, along with antioxidants, helps improve hair density and diameter. It also reduces hair loss. Omega fatty acids help your cells work correctly and can boost immunity, leading to better overall health. 5. Onion Juice Onion juice has been shown to promote hair growth and successfully treat patchy alopecia areata an autoimmune condition in which the body attacks the hair follicles and causes hair loss on various parts of the body. Onion juice is also thought to improve circulation.
Animal studies show improved keratinocyte growth factor, an important mediator of hair follicle development and growth. To consume onion juice, blend a few onions and squeeze out the juice. Apply the juice to your scalp and hair, and leave it in for at least 15 minutes. Then, follow up with shampoo. 6. Rosemary Oil Rosemary is a common essential oil that people use to promote hair growth and reduce hair loss. Rosemary oil has been found to stimulate new hair growth and can even be used to treat androgenetic alopecia, a type of male baldness. Mix a few drops of rosemary oil into a carrier oil, like argan oil or jojoba oil, and massage it into your hair and scalp before rinsing. You can do this a few times per week. You can also add a few drops of rosemary oil into your shampoo and conditioner on a daily basis. However, you shouldn't use essential oils directly on the skin, and you should always mix them in a carrier oil or shampoo. 7. Lemon Juice or Oil You can use fresh lemon juice or lemon oil, since they've both been found to enhance hair quality and growth. Lemon oil may help you maintain a healthy scalp and encourage hair growth. Apply fresh lemon juice to your scalp and hair 15 minutes before you shampoo. You can also use lemon essential oil diluted in a carrier oil as part of a hair mask. The above seven methods are the most commonly used natural remedies to regrowth your hair at home. Can I use natural hair regrowth methods with other treatments? Naturally regrowing your hair often requires a multi-directional approach, which means you may have to combine different approaches for the best results. If you are currently under a physician's care for hair loss, and you want to combine natural methods with your medical treatment, talk with your doctor to make sure there are no concerns or possible contraindications. The bottom line To improve your hair, you need to come up with a plan and stay consistent. Remember that the treatments may take a few months to yield noticeable results. Be creative with the remedies and mix them up as much as you like. It's important that you take time each day to focus on nourishing your hair. Taking this step and practicing self-care are beneficial if your hair loss is related to any emotional or stress-related issues. Do your best to maintain a healthy lifestyle that complements your hair treatment plan. Health is very important to everyone. Don't let other activities consume all of your time and energy. Proper awareness and attention to early signs of abnormal symptoms are keys to keep us healthy. Early treatment is always more effective than late emergency actions. May you stay healthy and have abundant of happy life. Please like and subscribe this channel for more health related videos. Thank you.